Hi, I'm here to talk to you about starting a home health care business. Starting a home health care business. Starting a home health care business differs from many small businesses because it comes with significant compliance, responsibility and liability requirements. While home health care is a burgeoning field with strong profit potential, it also demands a lot of care and forethought. Even though your business is essentially an agency and works without medical facility walls, you are still providing medical services that are regulated and come with significant risk exposure. Incorporation Providing health care is serious business. Therefore, you need to approach it from the perspective that, at some point, you will probably face a lawsuit or liability claim. Taking on full liability, as in a sole proprietorship, is very risky. That's why home health companies usually incorporate or choose another liability protection business structure such as a limited liability company or a limited liability partnership. Licensing Your state's Department of Health oversees all health care providers. Find out what all their requirements and provisions are for a home health business. Before you get their seal of approval to operate, you'll have to make sure you can demonstrate full compliance. Some key items usually include having copies of your clinician's valid licenses on file, taking examinations that show you understand the state's laws surrounding health care provisions and having written policies that include standards of care and ethics. Liability Insurance all that risk exposure means you need liability insurance. Ideally, you should have insurance that protects your business in general, plus professional liability insurance for your clinicians and workers' compensation insurance. Generally, all of these insurances run to the more expensive side with home health because employees are not in organized health care facilities and are out of your supervision. Health coverage Because home health agencies work largely with the elderly, you want to be a Medicare provider. However, becoming a Medicare provider requires you to comply with the many regulations and procedures Medicare requires. You will have to develop billing, treatment and documentation standards that comply with guidelines set out by the Center for Medicare Services. Hiring. Hiring clinicians to provide home health services requires a lot of thought and care. You have to trust that your registered nurses, licensed practical nurses, physical therapists, occupational therapists, speech-language pathologists and respiratory therapists can perform their duties properly and safely without any oversight. You also have to trust that they will conduct themselves professionally and courteously as they represent your company. Just as importantly, your clinicians have to take care of their own safety as well as that of their patients. Click the link at the bottom of the video or in the description box to visit Top 10 Senior Care Franchises. Hope you found it useful. For more information please click the link in description.